All right, guys and gals, welcome on back. Cases number five and six coming up today. Case number five on this video is a jumbo case. We're going to start it off today with a jumbo case, and we'll finish again with a hobby case for case number six. Welcome back, everybody. Al, welcome back, good sir, Mr. Fry. Hey, JJ, good day, good sir. Oh, boy. Feeling like a Miggy fine day today. Let's see if we can get some Miguel Cabrera action for you. Future Hall of Famer, by the way. Always a nice add-on when you can add something like that there. Well, let's get on with it here. Let's do a quick time check. Just a couple of minutes past due. Again, hope everyone's having a great start to their Wednesday out there. Off we go. Looking for a few things that we haven't seen. Looking for a nice auto relic. Looking to see if we can get a 101 in any, any which way. Relic, autograph, parallel. I haven't seen a printing plate yet. Cool to see a nice printing plate. What else? Reverend's Patch Auto. We hit one in the team breaks. Haven't hit one in the player breaks. Would be cool to see one of those as well. All right. Again, we're minus three hits. So going into end of case number 10, we are adding an extra box, jumbo box worth of content. So do stay tuned in that regard. And fingers crossed, we are making sure we're counting our hits in the jumbos. It seems to be where the issue has been every now and then. Oh, looking for a silver pack autograph. Did get the... Nice Joe Adele yesterday. 1099. Looking for a nice color on the autographs. That's all. <laughs> Nick, welcome aboard, good sir, as well. Gabriel. Mookie Betts on the box topper to lead it off here. Griffey Jr., Frank Thomas, Greg Maddox, Nick Madrigal. Oh boy, Let's see if we can get you some of that junior action on the board. Nice on the chromes here. Andres Jimenez, Casey Mize, Yelich, and Paul Goldschmidt to lead it off here. I think we usually see about three numbered parallels on the chromes per jumbo case. So I'm sure we'll run into three colors. Looking to find that auto or color autograph. All right, off we do. Well, James K, which means Alec Bohm, right behind him there. We'll peel him off as much as we can. A nice day as well for the Bohm spot yesterday. Nice black parallel, gold parallel, among others. Lead it off. Washington Nationals team card, gold here. Tony Gwynn, Willie Mays on the inserts. And a Justin Verlander foil. <laughs> what the groovy have? <laughs> so good yeah, so I should know. That's a good thing to bring up there, Roy. If we ever pull something like a dual player, it's normally a random card. But if we pull something that big, we would slow down, contact you guys. I would. I would argue that it'd be better if you guys could, uh, you know, buy one each, buy one and another out, come to an agreement on price, so that each buyer gets something, or sell the card and split it. But yeah, definitely on the big hits, we slow it down just to make sure everybody's on the same page. Zero so, would be a good problem to have on our hands here. <laughs> 
Chris Bubeck, Gold Foil Rookie. Kyle Lewis, John Lester on the inserts. Did get the Bubeck autograph yesterday on the 86 retro autographs. Nice gold foil rookie here. The King Solomon approach. <laughs> oh, thank you, Philip. <laughs> yeah. Will Smith on the uh, rainbow foil. And here's our relic. 86 retro upside down bow. JJ, a little starter here with the Jersey Relic, Boba Shep. Coming off the nice cap patch to 10 yesterday. See so if we can add to that. Bellinger and Will Clark on the inserts. All right, so that's our first hit there. We'll keep track on these. Nice Will Smith rainbow foil. I got a few clinkers on this one. Dang, dang it. Okay. Bo Burrows, gold foil rookie. And there we go. Little Petey on the parallel side now. There we go. Nice red foil. Pete Alonzo out of 199. Belly Baez on the inserts. And P, number 103 out of 199. Let's see if we can get some of that action on the chromes as well. We don't light on the chromes. Some spots I haven't seen as much. So, Jimmy, let's see if we can get you some of that trout action as well on the chrome side. Been a little light on his count. Ollie Perez, foil. Glaber and heater inserts. Yeah, Jeremy, I love the inclusion, right? Uh, red foil, orange foil, green foil, new new parallels this year. I think it really lightens it up because there kind of was a gap in the parallel, um, right, with flagship tops, <clears throat> right? You'd go from what? From the base set parallels from 99 vintage all the way up to gold. So there was a pretty big gap in there. So I think it's much needed in that regard. Spices up the parallel pulls per case a little bit more. Although we don't see a lot of them, I think we only see like four or five of the new foils per case, but it's a nice addition. Mark Canna, a gold foil, and commemorative logo patch, the Dodger. Clean Kershaw, going to put it on the board with this one. Trout on the 86, insert Derek Jeter, Platinum Players Die Cut. Notice that on the back, that's a looks pretty good on the front as far as centering or cut goes, but <clears throat> a little off on the back there. Goodness, just a little bit off, but I'd rather have it be off on the back than on the front, though. Unless front wise doesn't look anything wrong there. Okay, so now we're down to the autograph view. Ulak, Christian Pache, base rookie. Adalberto Mondesi, foil, and gold parallel, Josh Bell. Jackie Robinson, Tony Gwynn on the inserts. 
It's our second gold of the box here. Seventeen forty nine out of twenty twenty one. Willie Calhoun, gold foil. Joey Votto, a six and history of tops number three. Auto, auto, where art thou, auto? Yeah, Shakespeare's in cardboard, right? <laughs> Alec Bell, number two, right? Yeah, that's number two out of this box. Lou Patino, rookie. Direction Profar, foil. There it is. Bell Burrows. Um, did we get the gold? Got a parallel on Bow as well here, and the autograph. A foil. Uh, with the foil rookie, add the 86 retro on card rookie autograph. Congrats, congrats. All right, three hits accounted for. Christian Javier on the 86 rookie inserts. Richie Jackson, seven years of tops. Let's see if we can get a short print. Something on the rear side here in this last jumbo. Homer Challenge card, that's right, totally forgot about that. Nolan Arenado, Gold Foil. Home Run Challenge, Fernando. And something stuck to him here. Parallel, oh, nice one too. Albert, there it is. Green Foil, Pujols to four ninety nine. Pulling for a good one, good pulling for a good season here for Albert. How good as can be at least at what 40? Just turn 40. Pretty active in the parallels here two golds, the red foil, and the green foil. Uh, nice on the Tatis as well, home run challenge card. Congrats and good luck on this one. All right, interesting little box there. Kershaw on the commemorative logo patch. Bill Bichette on the jersey relic. Bill Burroughs rookie autograph. Some nice parallels in there with the Pujols and the Pete Alonso numbered. Box number two. We can get some silver pack action going here. Yeah, but just about every other jumbo box has a parallel, it seems. Although I think we started the case over three before, so maybe it depends on the sequence here, but within the given case. Cody Bellinger on the 51 All-Star Box Topper. <laughs> A little off the back. <laughs> uh, what do we got? Blue on the parallel to 150 coming up. Al Buster on the Chrome. DeGrom, Nolan Arenado, and good luck. Tyler Stevenson, rookie blue refractor. Put it on the board. Congrats on this one. Number 72 out of 150.
Yeah, if you remember back, so love the parallel, foil parallel inclusion. Really love the uh, chrome card inclusion here, the silver pack chromes, which I think they started in 2017, right? Prior to that, did not have those. So really kind of made some nice progress on the flagship top set here in the last five, six years with those inclusions. Major additions, I think. Look forward to them every year. Key Brian Hayes, Max, Don Mattingly, and Ozzy. Has a cool Mattingly photo there with the, and the iconic follow through there. Nice little chrome rookie key Brian Hayes. Keep an eye on him as well this year. Some outlets have him taking the National League Rookie of the Year award as well. No, it's a lot. <laughs> we haven't even started yet, but. They said that with Gavin Lux last year, too, so take it for what it's worth. Garrett Cole, foil. Blake Snell. Pedro Martinez on the seven years of tops. Vintage baseball cards. Shoot me a list. I don't mind uh, shooting. I got a pile of base I can filter through. Got some leftover on uh, from some team spots as well, so not a problem, good sir. We'll have a few days between this break ending and shipping, so I'll have a, I'll have some time to maybe look through those. So shoot me a list on eBay, and I'm uh, more than happy to help out on those by any means. If they're base cards, uh, I should have a few of them. Nice, haven't seen this one yet. Nolan Ryan on the image variation short print in the good old Astrodome. <laughs> I can't see the Astro. I keep thinking back to Bad News Bears. I'll let them play. <laughs> All right, nice one here. First short print. Let's check the code, actually. I don't think it's this one. It is the standard variation short print. Congrats, congrats. Nolan Ryan. Image variation. Short print. Pirates. Gold foil team card. Ichiro. Devers on the seven years of tops insert. Oh, Jimmy. We actually found some in store, huh? That's interesting. Pache. Or did you... <clears throat> Did you get them online or on in the store? I assume I haven't seen anything online. I mean, minus eBay and stuff like that. Jose Urina, foil, major league material jersey relic. Miguel Sano on this one. McGuire and Ripken on the inserts. Fernando base. Hey, hey buddy <laughs> all right cool deal glad you got it and you're always welcome man always try to throw in something there on those for you yeah mail's a little been a little slow even uh domestically around here so good to see it's still working internationally at least on some fronts there ryan brazier gold foil Donnie baseball the fresh crew kit there nice trout seven years of tops insert Jimbo, see if we can get it going on the trout. Mickey Magical, James K, Alec Bone, Gavin Lux, Future Stars, nice sequence there. Edward Olivares, Boyle Rookie, 
and we got parallel or short print. Jonathan Daza on the orange. Yeah, orange foil parallel. One ninety two out of one ninety nine. Have the uh, Eddie Oliveris foil rookie. Derek Jeter, Christian Yelich on the inserts. Yeah, it could be. You know what it could be? Because he set those records more, probably. He kind of hit more of those records. I'm not sure. I'm just speaking off of assumption here. He might have hit more of those records as a Ranger, right, later in his career. That's what I kind of remember, too, was like Nolan in his older days as a Ranger. Uh, that just depends on when you grew up and whatnot, but could have something to do with that, right? He set some pretty iconic numbers in that uniform. Trevor Bauer on the League Leaders Gold Foil and Commemorative Logo Patch. Casey Mize, Black Parallel to two ninety nine. Two oh eight of two ninety nine. Congrats, congrats. Evan White on the 86 rookie insert. History of Tops number two on this one. Yeah, there's uh, Jumbo is a nice, you know, nice format because it gets a lot of the spots involved with the autographs, the relics. <clears throat> and um, you don't see that on a you know with the with the hobby boxes. You gotta open a full case to get everybody involved on the hobby. So, but like as we've seen, the hobby does have its advantages, as does the as the, does the jumbo. So we're gonna see more autographs, more relics in the jumbo cases. We do get a few more gold parallels. We do get more home run challenge cards. I think we get more base cards overall as well. Casey Mice, six to Sanchez rookies. Brandon Kinsler, foil. Bo on the 86 insert. Ozzie Smith, platinum players die cut. Amir Garrett, gold foil, and what do we got? Parallel. Benny. Bone Biage, Benny. Gold, Andrew Benatendi. Chipper and Bryce Harper on the inserts. It's about as much French as I know, by the way. <laughs> 190 out of 2021. Yeah, Tuffy didn't get a re good uh, chance to fully rebound there, too, because he had a really good 18. Josh Harrison and the autograph... Jorge Mateo on the 86 Retro Autographs puts the Mateo spot on the board. And congrats on this one. I'm trying to think if we've seen this one before. Mm, not sure.
Oh yeah, long time pirate. Nice Mount Castle on the 86 rookie insert. Derek Jeter on the through the years insert there. Last pack of box number two, case number five. Evan White, base rookie, Malik Smith, gold foil, and Nolan Arenado on the home run challenge card. Congrats, and good luck on this one. I don't think we've seen the Nolan on the home run challenge card as much. Oh, Jimmy, I didn't even see your comment up there. Targets limiting three per person? Well, that's good. I wonder if that's being implemented just at that store or if that's more of a company-wide policy that's being implemented. But that's, uh, you know, that's a step in the right direction. I'd be happy ripping three blasters. We really don't need to... <laughs> three per day? Because <laughs> I can come back tomorrow. <laughs> Barry Larkin and Shohei Otani on the inserts. Again, we have box topper odds. Uh, one in 251 for the uh, box topper autograph on the bottom of the box there. They put the odds. So if you're curious, box, they usually put box topper odds on the bottom there. Most products, or most top products do. There's Ronald, all right. Jason, let's see if we can wake up Mr. Ronald here for you, good sir. On the 51 All-Stars box topper. And he was on the Chrome set. Just saying. Flaherty. Sunny Gray. Luis Robert. Evan White Rookie. And yeah, curious to see the Encore for a few guys too this year, right? Of an abbreviated rookie year. Luis Robert, certainly one of them. Ichiro, Robin Yao, George Brett, Joey Bart. Box number three. Where's <laughs> the biggest fist get those boxes? <laughs> Battle of the Savages. <laughs> Gabriel. <laughs> Am I aiming not to get stuck in your target? Juan Soto. Nice foil here. Ripken Jr. and... Bobby, Roberto Clemente on the Stars and Service insert. Let's see if we can add to it on Mr. Soto here. They did put him on the front of the product as well, um, right? So there is some sense of having to deliver on that spot. That's kind of like the athlete cover. <laughs> it's the hardest guy to probably hit in some sense. Jay Bruce, gold foil. Rendon on the 86. Justin Verlander, platinum player's die cut.
Yeah, Nick, to be honest with you, I, I have the same kind of situation. I, more, more often than not, whenever I do take a time to stop and look in the store, not finding anything either. I've been paying the premium, just get, grabbing them off eBay, to be honest with you. Been able to find blasters, uh, well, originally at uh, $24, $25. They're like $26, $27, the cheapest you can find them right now. You know, given the whole cost of time and running around looking for them, I'm uh, content paying a little bit of a premium. I, I can justify it on my end. It's like, you know, an extra 90 cents a pack to not have to go look around for them, so put it like that and it's like well hit to buy it now <laughs> right nice Mitch White gold foil rookie but I mean that's if you're doing that on a personal basis over like a few blasters but right? if you're trying to get like 100 blasters probably don't want to overpay too much then but just to get something to rip All right. and a bunch of conversation coming up over the next several months Trevor Story all the short stops really that's going to be an interesting group to follow this year the free agent short stops coming up nice Rizzo foil and Mitch White number 300 out of 2021 nice gold rookie Xander and Blake Snell on the inserts. Well, Thomas, I was saying, you know, paying a premium as far as what you can get them in the in Target or Walmart for what they're going for on eBay. It's about an 80 cent, 90 cent premium per pack. So give me what? Six, seven, eight packs. You're paying an extra six, seven dollars at that rate. I know it's not nothing to scoff off, but all right, given the time. I was looking for them and being disappointed. But, I mean, if you're at the store and you're just doing shopping and casually browsing, then, yeah, go for it. But if you're going out of your way solely to look for them and not find them, that's sunken time, sunken cost. Ill-advised. <laughs> Been there, done that. Yeah, it also never hurts. I'm probably sure they don't want you doing this, but never hurts to try to get the... Uh, the, uh, the the UPC code and to call them in and be like, hey, do you carry this product? Do you have it in stock? I've actually gotten a response like that before at the front desk, so they can check those kinds of things. Although they don't want a bunch of people calling in, I'm sure. So it'll save you the trip of just going down there. Stephen Vogt, Foil, Trevor Story, and Albert Pujols. Although the one time they did tell me that it shows it in the computer, but that's not not a guarantee that it's actually still on the shelf. But if they don't keep them on the shelf, then it might be a little more controlled. Again, all hypothetical things might have changed as far as how they... Uh... Oh, here's an iconic patch card. How they display or how they offer the product instead of just putting it all, at one, all out at once. Travis DeArno. Okay, Jimbo, there we go. Put it on the board. Nice trout parallel. Green foil to $4.99. Nice. And who do we got on the iconic patch card? He is sliding. Who is that? Thurman? That is Thurman. Oh, we got another one. Very nice. Couldn't hit run in 15 cases. So about 16 cases with all the team breaks we did. And there you go. Two in the first five. I call that a better draw. Nice. Excellent. Good, sir. Get a, a thicker one here. And that is a particularly cool one, too, with... sliding in that image very nice congrats good sir and let's see if we can find another here they are out on the gold foil and then Jimbo 
Yes. Very nice. Oh, the trout orange. I'm sorry, orange. Green foil. This one numbered 108 out of 499. Put up those parallels. George Brett. And you know what? That's the first insert, too. Gosh. Yeah. How about that? We got two of the patches before we got two of the base inserts. So I apologize that it's particularly behind on these inserts, but all right. I'm getting Thurman caught up here. Yeah, it's an athletic for sure with those <laughs> with those colors. It's an athletic. I just have no idea who that is, though. Not that it matters, but just out of curiosity. Oh, you actually painted a picture of that card. Super cool. Yeah, that's an iconic image, right? Seen it more than uh, just on that card, especially with Thurman, Manny Machado. On the foil card, Gladdy on the 86 insert. History of Tops number nine. What was that, our third one? Yeah. Three History of Tops in the first three boxes here. Hugh Darvish, League Leaders, Gold Foil, uh, Matt Chapman, and Vlad, so that's, yeah, okay, they're different images, that's what it is, I didn't realize that, I thought it was the same card, gotcha, so same design, just different images there, one is the 70th, 70 years of Topps insert, one is the 86th insert there. League leaders on the uh, wins at league leaders. You Darvish, gold foil. Oh, John, very cool, man. Keep me posted, John. Might pick up one, or maybe uh, I might have a customer. I might be able to maybe be a good one to pick up for. Oops, missed the Alec Bowman rookie off the top there. Matt Olson, foil. Parallel or short print. It's a brewer. It's a gold. Omar Navarez and the autograph. Boom or boom. However, which way you want to pronounce it. There you go. Adding to it. Brent. Yes. Nineteen eighty six black parallel rookie autograph. On card. Numbered 128 out of a 199. Now just going over this one. Just a touch of white on the bottom edge. So there's, I mean, these are tough as is with the full black borders. And maybe I would say just a touch in the top edge, on the top edge. Otherwise, no major corner damage. Just a little bit of edge, I think, on that one. To 199, solid. So, yeah, pretty good, pretty good start on the case here. Willie Mays, Frank Thomas, Platinum Players, Die Cut. Last pack of box number three, case number five. Bobby D. Joe Adele, Stevenson, Alvarez, Mize, Sanchez. Great sequence to run into in a single pack there. Michael Lorenzen, gold foil, and wouldn't you know, Joey Gallo, home run challenge. Congrats and good luck to the Gallo spot on that one. 
Mattingly, Molina on the inserts. I gotta start keeping tabs. It seems like we're <laughs> good for one on a case. I don't, I don't know if we've missed him on a case yet. <clears throat> Yeah, he's getting got some hits on the board, right? Got the gold parallel, the black parallel is a big one, right? I saw a few of those going over 500 with bids yesterday. So <clears throat> nice, nice long-term piece too, because if he comes out and smashes it again this year, yeah, you're gonna see an uptick in those for sure. Foils on him too, right? Along the way as well. We got both foils. All right, one and two fifty one. Hope I don't. Miss, <laughs> I hope we don't miss that one, right? Then it's another two hundred fifty one. Jake Degrom on the fifty one All Stars box topper. Yeah, certainly with all the base, but you know, it takes a good good hit or two to kind of get it up there. So I think we've done that now, and uh, there, that spot sitting in a good position. Certainly got some other spots that could use a nice bump. Nice Davy Garcia, Solaire, Bellinger, and Chris Bryant. Gabriel, we're we gonna get the KB spot going here for you. Well, let's see. It's be a good sir. Green to 99. Coming up. Raffy Devers. Nate Pearson rookie. Dalton Varsho rookie. And you got to be a believer. Shane Bieber. Green refractor to 99. Fifty-four out of a ninety-nine, to be precise. Congrats there. Some nice rookies in that sequence too, with the uh, Pearson, Davy Garcia, Dalton Varshu. Mays, Sixto Sanchez rookies, David Dahl, foil, Bryce Furlander, stars and service insert, <laughs> <Get me>. oh. <laughs> sorry, just saw your comment there, all right, good to, good to see there, no problems on hand. Goldschmidt, gold foil, Joey Bart, 1986 rookie insert, Yelich on the seven years of tops insert, Garcia, foil, 1986 parallel, coming up, the judge, there we go, a little action on the judge spot, blue parallel in the 1986 inserts, Hobby Baez on the jersey relic, Soto, the insert, and Willie McCubby on the platinum player's die cut. Every case and a half on the blues here. 89 jumbo packs. I just want to kick start the judge spot. Javi, what is it? El Mago. Congratulations. 
congrats there. Yeah, Baez, Correa, Seeger, Lindor. Woo! That can be a whole lot of money going into a few people's bank accounts. Oh, that's going to mean, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and call a prediction. <laughs> Concession stand prices across the board are going to cost a little bit more in 2022. Right? <laughs> there's there's going to be a lot of a lot of money spent on a, on a handful of players. I have a feeling we're going to get past some of that bill. DJ LeMahieu, League Leaders, Gold Foil. Austin Meadows through and uh, Nolan Ryan through the years. I get, but I, at this point, right, I guess I'd be happy to overpay for a hot dog if we can get into a game anytime soon. Yeah, DJ. The impressive spread there on the batting average win. I wonder what the biggest uh, biggest difference between batting average champion and and runner up is. The biggest discrepancy is the interesting stat. Mitch Keller, Boyle, Bregman, and Tuve on the inserts. Jimmy, thirty dollars a beer. <laughs> oh, another iconic patch card. Uh, this one is a little wrinkled. Might need to steam, steam, uh, steam blast it there. Roberto Perez and Danny Duffy on the gold parallel. Who do we got? Albert. Yeah, Albert. Uh, oh no, Yadier. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't read it. Yadier, wrong cardinal. Nice hit for the Molina spot on this one. Lindor, Nolan Ryan on the inserts. Yeah, I have a tendency to do that, to glance at the image and not read it. Yeah, not advisable. Four forty-three out of. 2021 on the Duffy. 100 <laughs> Thomas, $100 boomstick. <laughs> <laughs> I've heard about those. <laughs> oh, nice. Well, however that plays out, right? In due time. Boom, Madrigal, rookies off the top there. Nice Ian Anderson, foil rookie. Frank Thomas, Albert Pujols. And I keep telling people back to the World Series game, right? On the big on the game that was the blowout where he got tagged, he should have been out of the inning with only given up two runs. If you look back at the tape, Ump missed the call strike three that would have got him out of the inning, clearly in the strike zone, and the un, and then the inning unraveled for there from there. So that's why I'm a big proponent on Robo 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 Umps, right? Get it, get it done right, because the integrity of that entire series, in my opinion, was compromised. That was a pivotal part of the series. Yeah, Dodgers might have been up a couple of runs, but they wouldn't have been up 10 runs. And that series could have played out differently. So, you know, for the integrity of the sport, I, 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 I'm sick of seeing those kinds of things. So hopefully they get it kind of address in the future I, and it, it's not to throw the umps under the bus i mean nobody's perfect so no, no matter what you do no matter what you do nobody's going to be perfect so you can't fault the umpires it's just the nature of the nature of the business but nfl got it right eventually right it's either right or it's wrong so
Just my opinion. The robots are coming. <laughs> Chris Paddock on the gold foil. Freddie Freeman. Reggie Jackson on the inserts. I can't wait for it. Who's going to be the first player to get ejected by the robo ump? <laughs> you can't say that, Bryce. <laughs> oh, I can see it now. <laughs> I said Bryce Harper because I'm looking right at his cards. <laughs> Not that he's like notorious for arguing or anything. But it would eliminate that too, right? I'm sick of seeing guys turn around with attitude and like, you know, that was a strike and it turns into like an emotional affair. It's like, come on, you know, it's a, it's a strike, it's a ball, move on to the next pitch. Jose Abreu, League Leaders, Foil. Matt Shoemaker and the autograph right behind it. Gold of Parallel and the Shoemaker. Jose Garcia, 70 years of baseball. We did see this one in one of the earlier cases. So number two for the Jose Garcia spot here. Double up. Congrats. Congrats. It's going to take some Yeah, Nick, it's probably going to take some time. Good that they're at least testing it, trying it out. But like anything, right, it'll probably take some time, but would seem to be in the step in the right direction that they're talking about it, thinking about it. I know it removes some traditional elements from the game, but so much of it that's frustrating because of the inconsistencies. And right, hey, for us, hate to hate to see Ian Anderson go through what he went through when he really shouldn't have. If you look back at the tape, he should have been out of that inning and on with his life. And the Braves would have had a realistic chance at that game as well. Steven Matz on the gold foil. John Carlo on the home run challenge. Congrats and good luck on this one. Mookie Trout through the years inserts. Matt, he's coming up on the end of his tenure here, so that's going to be an interesting year for Mr. Matt's here as well. <laughs> he's going to kick dirt off. <laughs> I'm sure I'm going to have to write in the rules if I no abusing of the robo um. Box number five. Luis Robert on the 51 All-Stars box topper. True, but I don't know. More times than not, there's anguish, right? There's, there's one side of it that's like, you know, traumatized so <laughs> let's eliminate the trauma if we can I think Bobby D you know I haven't seen much on Bobby D on the chromes here this might be a sequence we haven't seen as much with Tatis second silver pack and here we go it's an autograph cool deal second auto coming up first of this case obviously did pull one yesterday with a nice Joe Adele out of 99. Byron Buxton, Jordan Alvarez, and good luck, Francisco. And the auto putting it on the board. Evan White had a strong initial first few cases, and he's back. 
number 14 out of 199 Evan White on the Silver Pack Chrome rookie autographs congrats a good sir so yeah I've had a hot start took a, took a little bit off cut a couple cases off there but no doubt congrats congrats 14 of 199 So nice little bonus hit there. Those, those are not necessarily on the guaranteed side per case. Christian Pache rookie, more time. Max Freed. Or Maxi. Boyle. And Platinum Players Parallel, there's got to be a blue. Yes, it is. Frank Thomas, Platinum Players Die Cut Blue. And these are tough. Let me take a look at the odds here. These are like one in every 12 cases, I believe. Every 719 jumbo packs. 715. Yeah, you know you've been raking too much when you know the odds. <laughs> I've studied. <laughs> yeah, one in every 715. I don't even need to look anymore. Congrats, a good sir. JV and Bregman on the inserts. Louis Patino rookie. Brandon Crawford, gold foil. Petey. 86, Juan Soto through the years insert. Alec Bohm, Gavin Lux. Jorge Alfaro, foil, Glaber Day, Glaber Torres on the 86 Retro Jersey Relics, Lozardo, Jim Palmer on the insert, Nick, I think it was game three. I think it was game three that was the blowout. Was it game three or game four? Or was the big blowout? And I forget if it was the first or the second inning. I think it was the second inning. Or one of the early innings that escalated into like a seven run plus inning or something. Or I forget how many runs. But they scored a lot of runs after that. And I kept thinking in my head, I'm like, man, you know, it really shouldn't be happening like this. And I'm just like happy for, you know, happy as a Dodger fan. But not how, you know, you don't want to, I don't want to see my team win because of something like that. Not that way. Plus, you know, I wouldn't doubt that he was kind of emotionally kind of pissed off. Pardon my language. So, yeah, you know, when you start pitching angry, you usually don't do too well. At least what I've seen, what I recall personally. Mitch Moreland, gold. Buster on the 86 inserts. Reggie on the Platinum Players Die Cup. Jimmy, oh, that's, <laughs> that is tough. Those surprisingly carry good value. So, I mean, right, normally an insert, you're like, eh, no big deal. But they do carry a couple buck, and they're probably on the blues even more so. I'm not sure if there's any, been any completed sales on a blue uh, set on those. But I would imagine that's north of $100 on that, on that blue set. 
Detroit Tigers foil team card. Goldie and Rizzo on the inserts. Gold foil, Arizona Diamondbacks team card, and commemorative logo patch. There you go, nice key, Brian Hayes. Put, I don't know, I have not pulled that one. That's kind of cool. With the whole bucko kind of staring you back in the eye there. Buckos. <laughs> nice one there. Piazza Al Kaline, seven years of tops insert. Congrats, congrats. And yeah, I haven't pulled that one in all in all of our cases. So pretty tough set to get around on stuff. Pedro Severino foil. Hey, anyone want to play too? Ernie Banks on the variation short print. Very nice. And puts Ernie on the board. Check the code. Yeah, standard variation. Yeah. <clears throat> Didn't realize his power numbers early in his career. There. Super massive hitter. Man. Ernie would be getting paid putting up those numbers today. Congrats there. History of uh, Griff history of Griffey Blue round fifty Blue Edgar about five. Yeah, I think the history of tops ones are a bit tougher. Not sure I gotta check on the odds, but <clears throat> stars and service parallels are not easy as well. Those inserts are super tough. Brady Singer, Steven Strasburg on the inserts. Oh, Str Springer, Springer Singer on the eighty-six rookie insert. Quintana Gold Foil. Trey Turner. And wow. Double Boom. I haven't pulled this one. 70 years of baseball rookie autograph Alec Boom. Also got the 1986 black parallel rookie autograph to 199 in this case. So have at it, good sir. Brent. Starting to clean up on the boom spot in this one. Got the black parallel, gold parallel, few foils on the board as well. Congrats, congrats. Good so. Last pack of box number five. Yeah. Indeed. Off to a pretty good start on that one. Brian Godwin, Gold Foil, and Freddie Freeman on the Home Run Challenge card. And Parallel, 86 Parallel, Ricky Henderson, Black. Numbered out of 299. I saw Red Sox and Dodgers. I'm like, oh, it's Mookie. Forget that Ricky kind of finished the tail end of his career there going. Jumped around there, yeah. Well, Seattle, San Diego, Red Sox, and uh, a little brief stint with the Dodgers. I remember that real, real briefly there. Congrats on this one. Again, number 283 out of 299. Freddie Freeman, again. Congrats and good luck on the Home Run Challenge card. Javi Baez, Ozzie Smith on the inserts.
last box of case number five. Again, case number six set forward just a little over an hour from here. 415 Pacific, 115 Eastern. We'll get back with a hobby case. So also nice in that box, also addition, in addition to the Bohm autograph, right? We got the Evan White as well. So pretty sharp box there. Juanito, Juan Soto on the 51 All-Star box topper. And another parallel, purple. Coming up, purples are to 75. Austin Meadows, Ian Anderson, rookie. Manny. And... Alex Bregman. 29 of 75 on the purple chrome. Congrats, congrats. Last silver pack of this case. Mickey Madrigal, Leo Di Tavares, Otani, and Mookie. All right, we'll go over those in the recap here. Kaboom! <laughs> Kaboom! Tyler Chat, uh, Chatwood, yeah. Foil, Vladdy, and Piazza on the seven years of Topps insert. Tim Anderson, gold foil. Jesus, Jesus Aguilar, black parallel. Congrats, number to 70. Marte, Buster Posey, seven years of tops insert. Uh-huh. That's a good last 700 at-bats there. Coming through. Timmy. Looking at his stats there, uh, reassuring to see he put up another good performance after a solid 19 there, showing his breakout was no fluke there. 19 of 70 on the Aguilar Black Parallel. Evan White, base rookie. Louis Castillo, foil. Major League Material, Jersey Relic. Wilson Contreras on this one. PD on the through the years insert Clayton Kershaw 86. Wilson! Patrick Corbin, gold foil. Tyler Stevenson, 86 rookie insert, Aaron Judge, 7 years of tops insert. Take it the, was it one of the parallels, green refractor to 99. Some of the base cards here. Nice Kyle Lewis, foil, gold cup, Jesus, 
Future Stars Gold Parallel. Sander, Glaber on the inserts. Well, just a little touch of white on that bottom corner on the Lazardo here. I think too significant, but do you want to point it out? 734 out of 2021. Speaking of uh, right sophomore follow-ups, very curious to see Kyle Lewis as well, right? A pretty impressive initial debut in 19 cup of coffee, followed it up with a strong 2020. So would figure to see he's kind of not a fluke as well in that regard. Commemorative cap logo patch. It's a platinum 70th anniversary parallel. And this one, put it on the board, Mookie. Congrats to the Mookie bet spot. 38 out of 70. Brooks and Jeter on the inserts. Dodgers combo, Buki and Bellinger, Foil, Kettle Marte, Pujols on the Platinum Players die cut. Gordo, Alex Gordon, foil, gold foil, as a matter of fact, and yeah, yes, there you go, nice short print here, haven't pulled this one either yet, solid for the Derek Jeter spot, image variation, short print, let's check the code on this, two through zero, that is the standard variation, but that's the first Jeter we've seen here in almost 20 cases, so definitely a tough pull to come around on the check on the variations. Solid. Got some good ones in this case, too, right? Jeter with the Ernie Banks. And the first one was Nolan Ryan. All three of these. This is the first time we've pulled these in 15 plus, 16 plus cases, though. So we didn't pull these last break. Very cool. Tuve, Johnny Bench on the 70 years tops insert. Um, you know, I'm going to take a count here, Jeremy. <laughs> I kind of lost track a little bit, so we're going to make sure on the jump. We're going to count our hits at the end of each case just to be ultra ultra safe there. Ooh, wow, nice finish. Sixto Sanchez on the gold, on the foil rookie, and Christian Pache on the 86 rookie autograph. Nice hit here as well to finish. So two bow mottos, a Pache autograph. Evan White on the Chrome autograph, so pretty strong on the rookie autographs in this case in respect to those spots that did hit. On the Pache here, got a little bit of a soft, not soft, but a little bit of white on the top edge, top left corner there. Nothing too significant otherwise. Nice centering on the back too here, really nice centering on the back. Congrats on that one. And my Sixto Sanchez as well. Donaldson, Hank Aaron through the years insert. Last pack of case number five. Wade Davis, gold foil. Kyle Schwarber on the home run challenge card and inserts Garrett Cole, Big Mac.
space. Schwarbs. What's going on here? Oh, this one's... Huh. Well, got a little chip and peel from the machine up on top of this here. And it looks like it's pretty off cut as well. It's kind of, kind of a little bit of the next card coming over here. Well, that's alright. <laughs> uh, that's the kind of card where it's our, not going to be too big of a deal on the damage on that one. And a little bit of a ding on the corner here as well. So just a heads up overall. A little rougher on that one. Alright, well, congrats again to those spots that did hit. Let's see how this case did break down. We are... A little under one hour from case number six. Case number six is going to be a hobby case. Link is there at the bottom. And one, yeah, 115 Pacific, 415 Eastern. So was that 57 minutes from now? Minus the recapture, put us about a 45 minute intermission here. Well, about that recap, let's see here. Let's count our hits. Did get our autographs, six autographs. <laughs> Four on the 86 retro autos, two on the 70 years of baseball, and we did get the bonus silver pack chrome autograph. So let's go in terms of numbering here. And on the silver chrome autograph, Evan White, refractor autograph, number 14 out of 199. The boom, or the boom. Alec Boom, 86 black parallel rookie autograph. 128 of 199. 1986 retro rookie autographs as well here. Christian Pache, Jorge Mateo, Bo Burrows. 70 years of baseball autographs, rookie autographs, Jose Garcia, and Alec Bohm. Let's so got the autographs. Check on that. Let's check and see if we got 12 relics here in total. And do count the cloth patches here, so let's see. Quick count. Four on the commemorative cap patches. Three major league material, that's seven. Two, three on the 86, that's ten. And two patch cards, so that's twelve. Okay, we did get our twelve relics in that in this case, thankfully here. Let's go over the commemorative cap logo patches and a couple of nice parallels here. Numbered out of 70, last one that we pulled, Mookie Betts Platinum, 70th anniversary parallel, 38 out of 70. Black parallel on the rookies, Casey Mize, 208 of 299. And a couple of nice base here, Key Brian Hayes, Clayton Kershaw. As we said, two iconic patch cards in this case. Yadier Molina and Thurman. Nice on the Munson. Number two on the Munson. 1986 retro jersey relics. Three on the base side here. Glaber Torres, Beau Bichette, Javi Baez. Major League material jersey relics. Miguel Sano, Trevor Story, Wilson Contreras on those. Parallels and or short prints here as well. We'll do the parallels first, then we'll do the short prints. All right, lowest numbered parallel was the black parallel. Jesus Aguilar, black, 19 out of 70. On the Silver Pack Chromes, purple to 75, Alex Bregman, 29 of 75. On the Silver Pack Chromes, green refractor, Shane Bieber, 54 of 99. Hop along here. Silver Pack Blue refractor rookie, Tyler Stevenson, 72 out of 150. Nice red foil, Pete Alonzo, number to 199. Orange foil here, Jonathan Daza, numbered out of 299 on the orange foil. Nice 
1986 black parallel insert rookie. 283 out of 299. Platinum players. Nope, that's a blue. And a couple of nice angel foils here. Green foil. Trout. Numbered 108 of 499. And green foil. Albert. Numbered 117 of 499. Platinum players. Die cut blue. Tough hit on these. One in every. 12 jumbo cases. Frank Thomas. Make sure that's accurate. Sorry, take that back. One in every 358 jumbos. So that's every six cases mystically on that one. Sorry about that. Uh, 86 blue Aaron Judge on this one. And we see maybe one in every 90 jumbo packs on those. So those are pretty tough as well. Given that's a pretty big checklist as well. Uh, let's do the golds. Good good count of golds here. More so than the other case. Four, eight, nine gold parallels in this case. To 2021. Lazardo, Moreland. Shoemaker. Duffy. Navarez. Mitch White. Rookie. Benny. Josh Bell and Washington Nationals team card. Oh, John, cool deal. Didn't see the orange PD. Well, more than welcome there, good sir. Certainly looking to add more than that for you, but cool deal. Nice parallel as well on the red there. Loving the new foils. Three short prints in this case, and all first timers on the board here. Nice Nolan Ryan, Ernie Banks, and Derek Jeta. Let's do the uh, foil parallels here. Kind of light on the rookies, on the gold foils here too. Bo Burrows, Chris Bubeck, gold foil rookies. In addition, Davis, Alex Gordon, Tony Kemp, Corbin, Anderson, Godwin, Goodwin, Quintana, Diamondbacks team, Yarborough, Crawford, Matz, Paddock, Roberto Perez, DJ LeMahieu, Goldschmidt, Lorenzen, Darvish, Dearno, Sager, Jay Bruce, Malik Smith, Amir Garrett, Trevor Bauer, Ryan Brazier, Pittsburgh Pirates team card, Aaron Otto, Willie Calhoun, and Mark Canna. Those are the gold foil. Silver, silver foils. A few more rookies on this one, on the silver foils and or some future star or gold cup parallels here. Okay, on the rookie side. Edward Oliveres, Ian Anderson, Sixto Sanchez, nice Juan Soto here, Kai Lewis gold cup, and in addition here, Mookie and Bellinger combo card, Castillo, Chatwood, Turner, Severino, Tigers team card, Alfaro, Freed, Abreu, Keller, Lurie Garcia, David Dahl, Olson, Machado, Vogt, Rizzo, Harrison, Kinsler, Urina, Garrett Cole, Profar, Mondesi, did I miss one? No, Garrett Cole, Profar, Mondesi, Ollie Perez, Will Smith and Justin Verlander. So those are the rainbow foil parallels. Covered, covered. Let's do the home run challenge cards. One per box on the jumbos. In this case, Schwarber, Freeman, John Carlo, Gallo, Arenado, and Fernando Tatis Jr. 51 all star box toppers in this case. Soto. Luis Robert, DeGrom, Ronald Acuna, Cody Bellinger, and Mookie Betts. 1986 rookie inserts. We had six of them in this case. Stevenson, Singer, Joey Bart, Mountcastle, Evan White, Christian Javier. And Platinum Player Die Cuts. Platinum Player Die Cuts. In this case, we had three. Six, eight. 
Jeter, Ozzie Smith, Verlander, Frank Thomas, Willie McCovey, Peter Martinez, Reggie Jackson, and Albert Pujols. All right, gang, that's going to wrap it up on case number five. Again, case number six link is there in the chat. It gives us just about a 45-minute intermission, and we'll come on back and get the hobby case underway. Hobby case for case number six, and uh, looking to add, hoping we can hit a clear parallel, uh, clear acetate parallel for those spots that do have one. Also looking for some of the rarer side relic autographs. We haven't seen a relic autograph yet, so kind of Jones in to pull one here, a nice one here if we can. All right, gang. Do you thank everybody again for joining, hopping along, and watching? Appreciate everyone's contributions in the chat. Mm -hmm. Quick break. We'll be back in just a bit.